the great game's been going on not for centuries but for millennia. Perhaps you can trace this back to Alexander the Great. The outside players in the great game always change over the succeeding centuries. The Afghans, though, have remained the only constant in their mountainous uh, areas, uh, fighting off invaders, uh, resisting domination by outside powers. In the last century, the two competing outside powers, the Russian and the British uh, empires, uh, decided to uh, create a buffer state at the center of the Eurasian landmass, uh, and neither uh, would seek domination in Afghanistan. In the last quarter of the 20th century, with the Soviet invasion, ideology came into play, uh, of course, in the form of communism, which never uh, found uh, fertile ground in the Afghan Muslim society. Now, a second ideology uh, was uh, beginning to uh, push into the Afghan woodwork during the uh, Soviet occupation, and that was radical Muslim extremism. Uh, the Pakistani military intelligence and the Pakistani military uh, supported this. Uh, they favored the radical uh, Afghans in the resistance, even though the moderate Afghans, the tribal forces, the nationalistic forces, uh, did most of the fighting and dying. Uh, during this period, the Pakistani military intelligence, ISI, also brought in Osama bin Laden and other uh, radical Islamic elements from the uh, Muslim world to assist in establishing training bases and training Muslim extremists, not only Afghans, but others from Pakistan, from um, other, uh, Southeast Asia, Middle East. The site of Ai Kayyam at the juncture of the Kokcha River with the Oxus separates the rugged and harsh mountains of Tajikistan from the equally desolate landscape of Afghanistan. This site attracted the Emperor Alexander the Great to strike camp and build an encampment as he prepared to cross the Oxus. Today, the Taliban is three kilometers away from these historic ruins and the Northern Alliance controls the heights. I'm John Elliott. I'm at Haikarnam in Afghanistan, close to the border with Tajikistan, in the heart of Central Asia. I'm sitting by the banks of the river Amu Darya, better known in the West as the Oxus. This is a river steeped in history, because conquerors through the centuries have crossed this river, usually from north to south, irrevocably changing the history and destiny of the lands and peoples that they've conquered. One of them was Alexander the Great, who in the fourth century BC crossed from south to north and built an encampment where I'm sitting today. Almost 2,300 years later, on Christmas Eve in 1979, Russian tanks crossed this very river, kick-starting the Soviet invasion of Afghanistan. Tumultuous years later, when the Soviet forces withdrew from Afghanistan, different faction leaders of the Mujahideen transformed themselves into warlords, fighting each other for control of the country.
This set the stage for the Pakistanis to introduce the Taliban as a new player in the game. And they saw to it that the ranks of the Taliban's forces were betrayed by Pakistani combatants and international Islamic mercenaries from countries as varied as China, the Philippines, West Asia and Burma. There is hard evidence of the international Islamic conspiracy of Osama bin Laden behind the Taliban in the form of international prisoners of war of different nationalities taken by the Northern Alliance. These prisoners have been kept in an isolated and remote camp, making it very difficult for the Taliban to mount a rescue operation. What is your name? My name is Mohammed Saleh Hayat. And, and where do you come from? We are in Burma, but uh, nationality Pakistani in Karachi. And what made you come to uh, Afghanistan to fight with the Taliban? We have uh, uh, organization, organization. Name, name is uh, Islami Mahaz. My commander said me go to for fight. What is your name? <coughs> My name is Mohammed Israel. And where do you come from? From Pakistan, Peshawar. From Peshawar? Yeah. And why did you join the Taliban? The Taliban is Taliban is the Taliban is the same as the Taliban. 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 The Taliban is مطلب اسلام کا مرکز ہے اور ہم یہاں ان کی اصلاحات اس لیے آیا ہوئے ہیں کہ ہم ہمارا مقصد یہی ہے کہ ہم اسلامی لوگ ہیں اور بنیاد پرست لوگ ہیں ہمارا کام ہے کہ جہاد کرنا اور چلو یو اسپیک انگلش یس کڈ یو ٹیل می پلیز واٹ یور نیم از اینڈ وی یو کم فرام آئی کم فرام چائنا مائی نیم از عبد الجل واٹ پارٹ آف چائنا فرام سنجینگ پروونس فرام سنکن فرام سنکن اینڈ وائی ڈیڈ یو جوائن دا ٹیلیبین I come here for study religion. For religion? Yes. But for what purpose did you join a fighting force? Uh, I studied two months, but my teacher said me to go to the fight. Where are you from? Where are you And why did you join the Taliban? Where Sharia Kelly. Sharia Kelly. What job did you do in Karachi before you joined the Taliban? Karachi me pehle kya kaam karte? Karachi What is your name? My name is Salahuddin Khalid. And where do you come from? I am from Pakistan. And what is your profession, your job in when you're in Pakistan? And I am was um, commander of uh, Harkat al-Mujahideen organization. And why did you join the Taliban? The, my organization, Harkat al-Mujahideen, is a uh, fundamentalism organization. And my idea is um, as uh, Taliban idea. Therefore, we, uh, my uh, organization um, commander said for me, go with your uh, personnel with, in, with Taliban. What is your name? My name is Muhammad Shahid. And where do you come from? Uh, I came, I came to Karachi, in Karachi, national Pakistan. And why did you join the Taliban? Uh, I want uh, a, a religion, I want Islamic religion. religion.